the crypto space term maximal extractable value, prior known as minor extractable value, has recently attracted a lot of attention from cryptocurrency community. MEV is sometimes referred to as the invisible tax that validators levy on users of a crypto economy by rearranging and modifying transactions during the validation process. Okay, so what is MEV and how exactly does it work? A term MEV describes deliberate reordering, inclusion, or exclusion of transactions when creating a new block in order to maximize profit. Consider it as the additional value that can be extracted from a block by selecting which transactions to include and in what order beyond the usual reward and gas fees. Because miners have the authority to decide on transactions placement to extract more value, the term miner extractable value was created. As a result of Ethereum merge, validators rather than miners are now responsible for creating new blocks on the Ethereum network. That's why it is now known as maximal extractable value because it is no longer restricted to miners only. So when a transactions contain more complex smart contract information, by prioritizing some of them over others and arranging them in a specific order, additional profits may be extracted from it. The method of choosing and ordering transactions for financial gain is the core of MEV. So now we can take a closer look at the examples of MEV. Arbitrage. The same asset might have a different price on two different DEXs. An arbitrager will make a trade as soon as they notice this discrepancy in order to profit from it. When a searcher's bot recognizes a pending transaction and inserts their own in front of it, they are able to take advantage of the opportunity value. Front running. Let's say that there is a significant buy order still pending in the transaction pool. Searchers and block producers can order transactions in a block meaning that front-running is possible by them. That way, MEV happens when a smaller buy order is inserted before the trade to lock in a better price before the larger buy order, which would raise the price of an asset. Similar MEV tactics include sandwiching, which entails placing buy and sell orders before and after a particular price-moving transaction to profit on the price pressure coming from both sides. Liquidations. DeFi position may be liquidated if the market shifts and the collateral's value falls below a specific level. The involved smart contracts frequently reward or charge the transaction that initiates the liquidation. Any block producer or searcher can identify this type of transaction and add their own liquidation transaction to the block before anyone else, capturing the reward value. So, that's the end of the video around everything about MEV. Now if you have found the content helpful, don't forget to give this video a like and subscribe to our channel for more content like this. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video until then, goodbye.